Some exciting new research came out that shows one of the best ways that we can decrease our anxiety and depression is through movement. It doesn't have to be a lot. Actually, what the study found was that two and a half hours total over the course of one week was most effective. 30 minutes was just as effective as 60 minutes. And four to five times a week seemed to be the sweet spot for uh, realizing the benefits of exercise. So you can start small. This isn't something that has to take hours every day. A little bit of movement really does add up. One of the greatest things about this research is that it showed that exercise was more effective than other typical uh, therapies like medication. So this is something that we can be in control of, we can do on our own to care for ourselves, to manage our stress and manage our anxiety. Why does exercise work? Well, it increases our endorphins, which boosts our mood. It decreases our stress. It helps us to sleep better, which has a huge impact on mental health. And it just uh, you know, increases our self-esteem. It gives us a sense of accomplishment so we can feel good about what we've done over the course of the day. If we've just moved even for you know, 10, 20, 30 minutes. Why aren't our doctors talking to us about this? A lot of times they just don't have the time or resources. So they can briefly recommend lifestyle changes, but it's up to us as patients to take control of these types of simple behavioral changes that we can do on our own. And for a lot of doctors, lifestyle changes are seen as complementary or alternatives. And so we have to focus on behavior change on our own. And that's one area in which health and wellness coaching can really help. So give it a try this week. See if you can start to increase your movement, even if just for a little bit, four or five times a week, 20 to 30 minutes, you'll be surprised with the boost in your mental health.